gentlemen, you're reigning Miss Kentucky Newcomer, Amaraj, featuring, featuring this year's contestants who vying for the title. Give it up for Miss Amaraj. Fabulous, fabulous representative. Now, ladies and gentlemen, what we're about to do now, we're going to have our presentation presentation category where they will present themselves to you and it's a 10 point, it's a 10 extra points, okay, for this category. So would you please welcome to the stage contestant number one. All right. Fabulous panel judges, we're, we're quite, 
We're quite proud of this uh, fabulous panel. Also, real quick, do me a favor, give the proprietor of this pageant, who's done this for the last five years, a nice round of applause. Miss Lauren Taylor, she put all this together. She goes through all the, the, the headaches of it every year, and she, I think she deserves a nice round of applause. So let's hear from Miss Lauren Taylor. And now, I have the pleasure, great pleasure, of maybe not, because I don't see no man. And I hate to be announcing somebody, and she'd be like, bitch, you try to work me, you know I wasn't ready. Uh, I'm sorry. She is ready. Oh, it's that pretty. Ladies and gentlemen, this next performer, privilege of seeing her perform in Miss Continental, and for those of you who don't know what that is, yeah. turn around and ask your neighbor. Yes. And she had, not real loud, she said, girl, what's Miss Continental? Not real loud, honey, just like amongst yourself, sweetie. Uh, uh, but I had the privilege of watching her do a talent that was one of the most fabulous talents. It was one of those talents that make you want to get a tissue and say, Tito, hand me a tissue. Yes, it was fabulous. Ladies and gentlemen, it is our privilege to bring to this very stage the one, the only, soon to be Miss Continental and all Miss Moralo. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please give it up? Now, I gotta know that you all gonna welcome her. She comes all the way from Orlando, Florida. Okay, she came a long way to be here. So we wanna welcome her. And you know what? We have one of the best crowds in the country, and I know y'all can do this for Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the fabulous, the body beautiful, Miss Danielle Hunter. Oh,
Good evening, Louisville, and how the fuck are we doing? in the house, don't we, baby? Enough of that slow shit. I'm ready to get this shit going, right? We started a little bit late, but that's all right. Let's try this one more time. Good evening, Louisville, and how the fuck are we doing? Woo! Very good, you're getting the hang of it. Do we have some cocksuckers in the house? Are you one of those? Oh, yeah. We like that. You're a big boy, I like that. You would know what to do with all that, wouldn't you? Short Evans! We're going ahead of these ladies. How are we over here? Oh, you like a nice lady. How are you? Here, let me see if I can, like, talk you with that. You like that? Hell yeah! So, you here for a big pageant, or what? Then you shake your head, you know? Then where are you from? This is not Nashville. Louisville? No. I actually, I'm from Nashville, Tennessee. I used to, used to work for the connection there. Worked over here for every now and then. It's been like four years ago. And then I moved to Orlando, Florida. That is home of Mickey Mouse, in case you didn't know that. And we have thousands of faggots because they run the damn kingdom. Huh? <laughs> Male, female, who cares? Right. Well, you're just the kind of girl I like. How you doing there, lady? What's your name? Diane. Oh. You want to stay with me and get some tips? Oh, yeah. This is like the table of lovely ladies. What's your name? Melissa. And I guess you're kind of like that. She's the man. I'm sorry. She's the man. We have, these girls have hoes and pumps on and we got... All right, baby. How you doing? She wants something. Go get her something. Pretty good. I, I tried. Teaser? Don't tease her. Here, let me sit down. I need to see. You have to strap one on, but we can manage, right? Oh, here we go, here we go. Don't be hollering. The real? Yeah, do you think I take them off and put them on the dresser at night? No, I wake up every morning with them. Every now and then I get out of the shower with them. I go, what the fuck have I done? No issues tonight, right? So is this the judge's table? Uh, at this end, we have the little gay boys. And at this end, we have the little gay boys. The fish in the middle. Oh, how you doing, fish in the middle? Mary, that's a man in a dress. Don't let her fool you. That's all we are is men in dresses, but that's okay. We like that, right? Well, Lord wanted me to stall a little bit. Is she ready? Who the hell's next? I need a lineup. I guess I'm in C in this damn Can I have this or do you need that? I can give it back. Where are you going? Hey, hey, hey. Where are you going? Where are you going? You have a nice jacket on. Now run on. Get it. So what do we have over here? I need to see exactly what's going on all over the place. Who's this? Oh, Lauren's next. That must be why we're stalling. You're a lovely lady. What's your name? Angelique. Angelique. Oh, nice name. Name. I couldn't say it if I was drunk. What do we have over here? We have some little gay boys over here. You have pretty eyes. Are they yours? Or did you buy those? They're light brown. You bought those. They're very nice. What do we have over here? Oh, you have money. Money's good. We like money. You have money? Thank you. A dollar? Yeah. Come on. Let me see how much we can get over here. Just like a woman? Okay, that's perfect. We like you. What's your name? I didn't ask his name, I asked your name. Hello, Erica, and this is Greg. Greg, are you like the, the gay boy or the, like the straight man they drug up in here? Oh, you're the straight man? All right, straight man, come on. Oh, come on. Come on, I won't hurt you. Well, honey, that spotlight was... Will that spotlight swing around over here? Swing that thing around here. Okay. I, I don't bite. What are you going to, you scared of a little transsexual to be 
get your ass or something? I don't think so. Come on. Come on. Come on. I don't buy. Come on. Oh. I need, what do you drink? Could I get a beer? Beer? I need a beer and I would like a shot. Just like a little Kool-Aid shot or something like that. All right, you have to let her go now. I'm not going to buy it. What's your name? You can leave. You can leave. What's your name? You're gonna get free beer out of it, all right? All right, you need to run on this thing. All right, I'm gonna borrow this man for a minute. I've never had a straight man this scared of me. Well, I don't attack. Let him go. Come here. Now stand right there. Go. All right. You're scared. So what's your now? Don't go nowhere. What's your name? You owe me drinks. Greg. Greg. Well, thank you. I tend to forget these things. Is my don't go nowhere. Is my beer coming? Well, how long could it possibly take? It's like, what is that, 10 yards? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Hi, stay right there, Greg. So, what do you do for a living? You can't tell me? What, are you a police officer or some shit like that? You can't tell me what you do for a living. You're a bum. Well, I guess it takes all kinds. Now, is that what you want all these people to really believe that you're a bum? The only straight person, is this the only straight person in here? No. Oh. Do we have any other straight men? Mary. Where? Do you have more personality than this guy? You get a free beer out of it if you do. Okay. Hand them to uh, Greg here. Hand that to Greg. You got that? Thank you. All right, thank you. Okay, Greg, you got those? You know why I had you get both of those, right? So that I can show everybody I can feel your dick. Shoot, it's right. That's like a dead horse, bitch. She had about enough personality as fuck it. Is Lauren ready? I don't offend these. This is the Bible Belt. I don't offend people when I cuss, do I? No. If I do go to fucking hell, I really don't care. But, uh, a few years ago when I worked at the Connection, they would let me cuss. So, you know, down there in the Magic Kingdom, where it's very family oriented, every other word usually cuts work. Oh, I like this. <laughs> I feel like I'm a star search model or something. Here, take that for me. <laughs> At this, all right, I'm working on it, okay? <laughs> but this At is this, more entertaining. Yeah. How are we going? Okay. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, would you please give it up for the one, the only, Miss, what's her last name? Taylor. 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 <laughs> This is my daughter, by the way. She has changed her last name. It used to be Lauren Hunter. But I suppose along the way, she's either gotten married or she didn't. She just don't give a damn anymore. But at this time, would you give it up for Miss Lauren Taylor?
Yeah. You can suck. We're not the board. We're not the board of aldermen. Okay, we don't discriminate. <laughs> okay. Thank God you would never get laid. All right. So I got my own. I got your husband. You can't keep that was in the past. Didn't she a bitch? <laughs> if you can't keep him happy, I certainly can. Um, should we move along now? I think I'm the one that got the jewelry. <laughs> Should we move along now? Yeah, you should move from. Sit over here, girl. I'm going to. I'm standing here for just a little bit longer. I know your parents are hollering. I'm on TV and everything. Yeah. Uh, Isn't she beautiful? Isn't she beautiful? Woo! All right. Okay, I have my. Mom. I'm sure she will be one of your future Miss Continentals. Yeah, whatever. All right. <laughs> It seems like enough money to buy the damn thing. At this time, would you please give it up for Louisville's very own. The dazzling sensation. Let's hear it for Reba Devereaux.